Okay guys, this is the last episode 20, so I will mute my microphone so you can hear everything from now on, okay? Welcome, friend, to the Championship Duel of Wits. Well, the take-home version. Budget cuts or something. But, uh, look around, take it all in, and know we've already won. Our allegiance guarantees us both a spot on King Edward's court. How exactly is this going to work? <laughs> Before we get to the rules, I offer a toast and an opportunity. You see, while this game might stretch the imagination, for some I find it rather simple and in need of an additional mental challenge. Guards, the raisin juice, please. Hey, what do you say we make things even more interesting? I like the sound of that. Bring those cups back out here. But only two of them. Okay. Guards! Now, squeeze the last of the hypnotic powder in one. I like where your head is at. Guards, if you would mix, please. Now, I choose. And now you choose. Uh-oh. Turn that. I think the powder is wearing off. So you used hypnosis on Manny? You didn't try to beat him straight? There is no shame in cheating a cheater. I am ready for decree 3214.6 and a half. Actually, I think it was decree 1.21. Aha! We knew you could do it. You're out of the alliance. I can't lose to you. H how about another challenge? We only got to square off in a duel of wits. A well rounded gentleman would win in a duel of strength as well. Graham, take this. It's oh, these babies, huh? these, it's <coughs> okay, one more challenge. Uh, uh, how would you fare in a duel of speed? No, Manny, it's over. Just as the battle isn't always claimed by the strong, and the race isn't always won by the swift, sometimes the intelligent falter. And I think now is my chance. And now is my time. Come on, Graham. One more duel for a chaka. Do it for the village of starving uh, pitch threeans. Oh, you said his village was home to the itch twoans. What exactly is your plan here? Because I'm starting duel to. Duel of speed! Oh, 
Don't cry him. He's not worth it. With the bridge strike resolved, supplies can be delivered to the shops again. Business started to pick up. The Wetzel Wolves stopped harassing the town and migrated north. Even the guards marched with a little more caution in their step. All things considered, it was a pretty good first day in Daventry. That was... that was amazing! I mean, you faced a dragon, you made weird new friends, you battled for wits. I... I just don't get it. Get what? With your busy schedule, how did you ever find time for a night job? Huh? Was that... did you just make your first pun? I think I did. I'm not sure how I feel about that. <laughs> they grow up so fast. The tournament! It's about to start! Well, you best get out there, young lady. Good luck. And remember what I told you. Take on the duel with quick-wittedness. Thanks, Grandpa. You've always guided me straight. Are you going to watch? Of course, of course. <clears throat> I'll be down momentarily. Hope you practiced, Gwendolyn. Nope. Just listen to stories. What? <laughs> I'm not sure I like this. You're such a bizarre creature. Get back here! Ah! Oh, horse feathers. Egg! Exactly. Cannot believe I just said that. Children! Children! Come along, quickly! It's your grandfather! Sadly, that's the end of chapter 1, and the next chapter costs money, so in case you see this and you want me to play through the second chapter, just tell me, and I will do it. See you guys. I thought this game was a lot of fun. Really fun. A lot of puns. If you compare it to other Sierra games, I think... It was more based for a younger crowd because the older games of King's Quest was much harder. But see you guys. Have fun. <laughs>